for some reason, my opponent got really excited. He rewrote his speech real quick. He stood up at a rally, proudly declared, I'll get the job done from the inside. What kind of inside job is he talking about? Yo, listen up, I'ma keep it real. I'ma tell you motherfuckers how I really feel. Uh-huh. Here's the deal, these clowns are whack. We wanna go forward, but they wanna go back. Here's a fact about Paul Ryan. He sees a microphone and starts lying. No denying, the fact's been proven. You know that he's lying because his lips are moving. Mitt Romney is full of crap. He couldn't find Russia on the Russian map. Hides all his money inside Swiss banks. He want to be the president, thanks, but no thanks. Obama cares with Obama care. Yo, we're in trouble, but Obama's there. People need to listen, this is not a game. Mitt don't give a shit, he wants power and fame. When I was a boy, I used to think that becoming rich and becoming famous would make me happy. Boy, was I right. Corporations are people, my friend. We can raise taxes on... Of course they are. Everything corporations earn ultimately goes to people. So, where do you think it goes? What, what? Let's talk about job creation. His state was 47 in the whole nation. If he can't even fix Massachusetts, tell me how the hell is he supposed to do this? Always smiling, no tax filing. He's Thurston Howe from Gilligan's Island. Pays no taxes, he's a deadbeat. He sees us all as numbers on a spreadsheet. He don't care about none of us. If you're poor, you get thrown up under the bus. The rich get rich and the poor stay poor. I'ma give Obama four more for sure. On election day, when I'm in that booth, Obama gets an X cause I vote for truth. You wanna vote Romney, well that's your call. But if he wins, it's a rap. God help us all. God help us all. I like being able to fire people who provide services to me. If, if, if I, you know, if someone doesn't give me the good service I need, I want to, I want to say, you know, that, that I'm going to go get somebody else to provide that service. I'm going to eliminate every non-essential, expensive program I can find. That includes Obamacare, and I'm going to work to reform and save... See, Romney says that he's got your back, unless you're poor or gay or black, or a child with needs and a tiny voice, or a woman who fights for the rights of choice, or you want to go to college with the student loan. The only thing he'll leave you is he'll leave you alone, in the land of the free where the buffalo roam, he be chewing on steak while he throw us a bone. See, the rich succeed with the corporate greed, they like pigs and slop with the way they feed. He outsourced jobs to a distant land, while jobs in America are in high demand, yo, I demand that the madness ends, he wanna cut taxes for all his friends, he don't give a shit about the middle class, I wonder how it'll look with my foot in his ass. The Romney campaign is in crisis mode, scrambling to explain a secretly recorded tape where Romney tells wealthy donors nearly half of all Americans see themselves as victims. He talked about citizens who see themselves as victims, pay no income taxes. He went on to say his job is not to worry about those people. You mean poor people? I got a game plan, and my game plan is this. I'm going to re-elect Obama, and in four right. more years, I'm going to vote for Michelle Obama. Hell That's yeah. right. And after their kids get out of college, I'm going to vote for them too, and I'm going to tell you why, because I believe the Obamas care, and I know Romney don't. I think he's a creep who hates people. That's right. And he doesn't believe that gays have the right to get married. And I believe that gays have the right to be just as miserable as the rest of us. And if they want to get married, God let them. He doesn't even believe in global warming. In fact, he's not going to believe it until he's sailing his yacht up Fifth Avenue on the way to the Cayman Islands to drop off some more of his tax money. He doesn't believe in a woman's right to choose or for her to get the same pay as men. Has he not heard the old saying that hell hath no fury like a woman scorn? And ain't this the same guy that said if you want to start a small business, you should borrow money from your parents? Well, if my parents had money, I probably wouldn't need to borrow money, would I? And do not get me started on his dog. This is a creep that drove 12 hours with his dog strapped to the roof of his car while his Louis Vuitton luggage sat nice and warm in the back seat with his kids. Let me tell you something, folks. This guy is the Michael Vick of politics, and if you vote for him, then you're a bigger creep than he is. Word up. 
And don't even let me start on this Paul Ryan guy, man. This guy's like Pinocchio Jr., man. He lies more than a Persian rug on his daddy Mitt Romney's floor. This guy should be a wrestling announcer. I'm Barack Obama, and I approve this message.